I've always loved and enjoyed the world of art and poetry and loved the way artists could transform blank canvases into something so powerful and meaningful and how poets could bend words and bend languages as if there were no barriers. Over time, the love for these two things granted me opportunities that I would never forget. It turned a whole new leaf for me. I was able to partner with companies and start youth projects and engage with young people in our community. Always been a method of expression, whether it's bad expression or good expression positive emotions or negative emotions. It's like having that best friend you can talk to continuously, tell everything to, always hang around with. And it's always been there for me in life. I ask my friends what they think art means to them and poetry means to them and how it influences them as well. And this is a response they had. The first thing that comes to mind when I think of art is just pure expression. So even during the, uh, take it back to the caveman times when they were drawing inside the caves, you know, literally just expressing what they've seen, expressing how they feel, expressing their stories. For me, more so through literature and fashion, that's where I feel, in an art sense, most connected to my culture. I also use poetry as a way to express my opinions about ongoing matters in this world that affect me, our culture, and my people. That was my journey through the world of arts and poetry. And it's always going to be a part of my life. Find the content of my character or reflect his opinions on the colour of my skin, my creed, or my personality. They are blind to my struggles, my pain, and my sacrifice. My ancestors have survived under the unforgiving hands of slavery. We have fought hard for our rights and have earned our long-awaited freedom. We thought that the cold grip of injustice would no longer hold us captive. We thought that the manacles of fear would be stripped off. We thought the race for equality and the battle for oppression would be brought down hand by hand.